What's going on, everyone? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. Folks, we're going to get into some really cool photos. We're starting with this one moon photo, and this is from Apollo 16. Now, when I show you the photo, now we've just covered this in my latest podcast. When I show you this photo, you can't help but to flag BS. Let's just jump right into it. Let me show you what I'm talking about. All right, you can see right here, this is hq.nasa.gov, and you can see the photo ID is AS16. Dash one one zero dash one seven nine seven three HR. There's another place to get it from as well. This one right here, and this is from Wiki Archives, and you can see that it's basically the same photo. Just one's black and white and grainy, the other one's more smoothed out and you know completely uh, washed out. Now you'll see like an arrow right here on the very right hand side of the screen, and there's one on the left. If you go to this one on the right. You can see it's just over to the right a little bit on this photo. Now, the photo I'm going to show you, it looks like somebody made like a mini pan because it covers both of these photos in there. Now, I want you to see this here. There is nothing in this photo right here in this area. And when I show you what's here, you're going to go, okay, that's bizarre. Why isn't it in these photos? This is why I keep saying, I think that these people are going back through these photos and modifying the photos even more so. Let's just jump into the one on Photoshop and show you what I'm talking about. Okay, you can see it right here. Okay, I'm going to go back. You can see the astronaut standing right here, and he's also taking a picture. You get some decent quality on this side. Not too bad, right? But what happened in the middle of this photo? What is going on here? Okay, you can see something's lined up over here, and you'll see it much better in a moment. But why the completely whited out? What's with the washed out? This is the object I was telling you about right here. What is this thing right here? It almost looks like a, an outline of the Batmobile. You can see the actual, what looks like fins in the back of this thing. Let me back up just a little bit because it gets really grainy. Now, what I noticed as I was going into this photo, again, try to bring out any lines we can. Now, folks, just for the record, I don't know what any of these things are. However, I do know the difference between natural and unnatural. There's things on the left and there's things right here in the middle. And like I said, this piece right here you can see it's just right of that highlighted area and you can see some kind of weird something or other sitting right there now let's go back into the photo where's it at it's nowhere to be found black and white nowhere to be found what's going on with these photos folks makes no darn sense see it nothing there at all nothing there to see i'll give you these and again you can go back and forth here and here the same photo and you can take it from there and rip these things apart yourself okay now folks right off the bat what do we have here look carefully you can see what looks like platforms right here another straight line somewhat not all the way but there's objects right here right here can you see them literally doing this takes a trained eye to see it but you'll see it there's something right here there's another one up here, it looks like some kind of overhang going like this. Now, that other object right here, you can see that. This is the thing I told you, you don't see it in the other photos. Why don't we see it? Again, there it is. Bring it down the brightness. And you can see the difference in this area right here. We'll go back and forth. See it? Okay, and you see I try to get rid of the brighted area here. Again, that object here on the right, you can see that. And then these other objects. So there's a couple ways I went with this to try to bring these objects out. Okay, now when I started to bring this area down, you can see what looks like lines, right? You can see something doing this, something doing this. So again, starting to come out. Okay, what's in here that's doing that? There's one here, something here. They almost look like columns, okay? Like coming down from a certain area. Looking over at this part, you can see these, again, these platforms right here. And some objects like sitting on some kind of weird platform. Let's keep going. All right, so let's black and white this and bring this stuff out. Okay. Over here is a complete mess. And understandably, because it's closest to the camera, so they need to do their best to really block this stuff out, right? Notice the objects on the end here. 
It almost looks like there's an overhang right here, and there's something right underneath it. You guys see that? So let me brighten up this other area of the platform it's sitting on, and we'll go from there. Again, we have things that look like are sticking out on this platform. And you can clearly see it's on something that's white. Some other weird objects in here. Here. Okay. All of this here looks like some kind of weird piping. You can see multiple things like right here. Looks like some kind of weird pipe sticking out right there. You can see it. This one here. Whatever this stuff is, folks, it's right here in the photo. We have other things right here on the hill. Notice this thing goes down like this. Not sure what to make of this stuff. See that? Slide over to the right. We have this object. We have something right here, very small. Going back to this area right here, very faintly. Looks like something's coming down like this. Very faint. Let's brighten up some of these other areas. Again, this object. Smaller object here and some other things here. And folks, just have a look at some of the things that are hidden in here. What is going on? Folks, to me, this is what this astronaut was taking a look at. We're going to back out. You can see he's got a flash right there. And that's what he's taking a look at. Check this out. Let's keep going. Let's see if we can bring it out a different way. Sometimes you can get better details, sometimes not so much. Here's the objects right here on the left. Okay. Right there, trying to maximize the lines, although sometimes it's not a good thing because you can distort it. Notice this area right here. What is that? It almost looks like some kind of weird piping. Looks to be like it's in some kind of weird box right here. And then there's something coming out over here. I can inside there and coming out. I'm not sure what to make of that, folks. Let's go black and white. Try to bring out more here. Notice that object right here, as I was saying earlier. And folks, just have a look. These objects are in the photo. And they happen to be lined up, and it looks like some kind of weird wall type thing, is it possible, and I'm purely speculating here, that this is some kind of spacecraft, and we use the term at a docking area where they just sit on a pad kind of thing, or is it structures? Is it machines? What are we looking at here? See this? And folks, you can just look at the background. You just see this is completely manipulated and, and censored out, right? This object right here almost looks like a structure or some kind of craft sitting on the ground. Again, this little object here and whatever this is right here. See this? If you back out a little bit, you can see these objects. This thing here, I'm not even sure what this is. You can see how it runs along. Goes all the way down. You can see this has been manipulated, so it's kind of hard to see, but you can still see that other thing right here. Going down. Folks, to me, this is a structure. Maybe multiple structures. We have what looks like piping coming down from probably back here, but because it's so centered out, you can't see what it is. And then we have these objects here. If you notice, I also highlighted this in the back. Not even sure what that is. But to me, this is what this astronaut was taking a photo of. If I was to do this, back to the original, a lot smaller. There's the astronaut taking a picture of what? The pretty landscape? Or was there something much more in here? And you can see at the bottom of the photo, it says photo credit, NASA dot uh, JSC dot panorama and illumination adjustment, Samuel G. Sola. What do you mean? Why would you have to adjust anything? Right. Because why? They didn't want us to see what's really here, which is basically this. I'm sorry, they're not going to go up there with a Hasselblad just to take pictures of eh, some wispy little hills. And when you bring this out, it makes more sense that this would be worth taking a photo of. 
Would you agree? I do. Folks, I'm going to leave it right here. Have a look. I'll do the color version here. You can see where it's whited out. But clearly you can start to see things take shape. Objects here and there. Another object way up here. There you go. There's a colored photo. Here's your black and white. Get rid of this. Give you the whole picture. Zoom in just a hair bit more. Right there in the middle. There you go, folks. Right there. Natural or unnatural. Folks, I don't know about you, but when I see these things, first of all, when I see the whiteout area, right off the bat, I believe something's being hidden. And there you go. Absolutely 100% being hidden. And it shows it right there. Illumination adjusted by this guy, Samuel. I like the idea of the panorama because it joined both of those photos together, like I showed you in the beginning, and you will get the links to that. But when you break it down and find the lines that are in this photo, you have to ask yourself, what's really there? What was this astronaut taking a photo of? To me, this looks like structures, or these things are some kind of craft sitting on a pad near a structure, and they're up against some kind of wall. So would it be a structure with smaller structures connected? Very good possibility. Whatever they may be, you can tell they're not natural. Simple as that. As always, folks, drop your comments down below. Let me know what you think. I'm always curious to see what you've got to say. Don't forget to like and share the video. It's always appreciated. And don't forget to give the video a thumbs up so that YouTube shares it. And, folks, i got some more videos coming up. And I believe I have two Mars videos, so stay tuned for that. Anyway, folks, thanks for watching. Always appreciated. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.